can I just say it's incredibly cringe when a guy who's not rich is worried about a gold digger. Can I just say that it's incredibly cringe when a woman that's not pretty is worried about being pumped and dumped. Oh, was that offensive? It's like me living in the desert, worried every night that I'm going to drown to death. It's not in your realm of reality. Also, rich men don't have a problem with gold diggers. Well, well, of course they don't. Now listen, it's not every single rich person in the world, but a lot of them are also morally unscrupulous individuals and don't have much moral consideration for their fellow man in general. What's this you say? Individuals that break the law to a master riches sometimes actually don't have a strong moral consideration for the women that they use? What? Wow! Of course. I mean, that's just reason one. But reason two is because whatever money that they give to the gold digger probably might be a flash in the pan or a drop in the bucket of their resources. $10,000 given to an individual that has $10 million ain't really much, which honestly should actually reflect how meaningless your relationship really is as a woman if you can be bought for $10,000. But... But because you immediately benefit from that $10,000 and it's more than you have now, you don't see that relatively it actually reflects how unimportant you really are. Again, because you just directly benefited from it, you're not going to question it. You're not going to think that it means that you're nothing. It doesn't mean that you're easily manipulated. And it doesn't mean that you have low consideration in the mind of this rich man. No, 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 no. You're using him just like he's using you, so it's okay. Again, it's just two morally dubious people using each other. I'm supposed to be surprised that he's not bothered by it? Come on, woman. Can you not insult my intelligence for, like, maybe 30 seconds? Can you at least try? Rich men know that their lifestyle is what sets them apart from other men, and they want a woman who's attracted to that because she Because they're easier to use. Why spend any amount of time trying to wine and dine them when I can just pay them? I can just, I can literally just fast track to the sex. I can literally just fast track to what I want. This whole courting thing, why would I need to do that? That's how they think. That's how they feel. And honestly, as a young lady, you would think that that would bother them. But it doesn't. So... So the idea that broke men worry about gold diggers is embarrassing. The idea that fat women worry about being pumped and dumped is embarrassing. Was that offense? Was that offensive? Now, of course, I will. I, I I want to say that this is just. It is a wonderful, wonderful expose of just the lack of honor a lot of attractive women have. I mean. I also think that it's really interesting to see that a lot of women love to kind of romanticize, I'm going to be honest with you, but villainous activity, all because they benefit for it. I mean, let's just replay this one here for a second, now, shall we? ...is what sets them apart from other men, and they want a woman who's attracted to that because she then appreciates what he's bringing to the table. He, he wants a woman that appreciates. That's why she's a gold digger. Because she appreciates his money. Now you're just playing with language. Now you're just trying to bend reality out of its shape. Not a gold digger make if she has a genuine appreciation for this man. If she actually loves him and she actually considers him a human being, then she's not really after his money, now is she? That would be a bonus to the relationship and not the entire foundation of which it's founded upon, dumbass. Anyway... Here's the thing. The reality is gold diggers take all different shapes and sizes. I don't I don't really typically mean that literally, but I mean it can. And really, the issue of a gold digger isn't specifically that they only target rich men. It's easier to see a woman be a gold digger. But a lot of ladies, and I've encountered them, I've had the misfortune of dealing with them myself, will use men as wallets. They'll just use men because they know they can get something out of them. And they'll call them up and try to treat them like a sugar daddy. I remember even back, I remember back when I was like 12. And I remember this girl came up and she asked me for a dollar. And I had an extra dollar. So I gave it to her. Here you go. I said, it was just being nice. 
And my friend looked at me. His hands covered his face. And he said, oh, Zerus, why did you do that? You just became a sugar daddy. And I was befuddled. I said, no, I didn't. But as the weeks went on, that girl kept coming back to me. And she kept asking for a dollar. <laughs> that was my first encounter, by the way. My second one was when I was when I was bloody 15. I remember I was, uh, there's another girl, uh, very cute. She came and she would ask me for a dollar. She was actually friends with, a, with another friend of mine. Um, and that's how I met her. And she just asked me for it because she was hungry. So I gave it to her. And she would, lo and behold, each lunch period, come up to me. And she'll make small talk. She'll talk to me. She'll say hi to me in the hallways when we saw each other. You know, she would have conversations with me. But ultimately, she'd always end up asking for a dollar, sometimes five dollars. And the, the day came where I didn't have a dollar for her was also the same day she never talked to me again. You see, my friend, gold diggers aren't women that just want super rich dudes. They're just women that have no moral consideration for the men around them and just want to use them for their money. That's all it is. Now, of course, for me, that was just back in high school and silly goofiness. But the point of telling those stories was to show you guys. Actually, the first story was me in middle school. The point of telling the story was to show you that this behavior is not relegated only for the upper echelon of society. It's permeated everywhere. Even young women still can have this inclination. It is preposterous and downright stupid and goofy to try to sit here and denigrate these poor men for not having the resources when any young lady can do this. They can be a leech to your life. They don't need you to have a lot of money. They just need you to have the money they want then. And there's nothing stopping them from taking money from you, Taking money from him, taking money from him, and him, and him, and him, and him. It's almost like that's the entire basis of this website we like to call OnlyFans. My friends, you must steal yourselves against women of such unscrupulous character. And you must not be swayed by the beauty of this harlot here. I am beyond tired of women pretending that this gross, nasty behavior is okay because it's only reserved for some women. It's not. Gold digging is awful. It's bad. It's terrible. And very, very, very dehumanizing. So can you guys stop thinking like prostitutes? You're supposed to be women. You're supposed to be ladies. We're supposed to be trying to find wives out, you bunch. Why do you guys keep acting so disrespectfully to yourselves and more than that so disrespectfully to the men that you're supposed to be finding yourselves in love with i don't know maybe that should give you guys something to think about with that being said i should leave you guys got something on today's video and if you did man you know go and click the like button and if you go and click that subscribe button come in the comment box below and as always you guys have yourselves a great day i'll see you cool cats soon Adios.